Hello everyone, uh, today I'm going to show you how to use jQuery in ASP.NET Core or you can say that uh, how to add a uh, JS file, a JS library in ASP.NET Core. Uh, so first of all, uh, your JS file is actually exist, is already exist in uh, the www root folder. So there is no need to uh, use uh, jQuery uh, uh, pre-built files like the jQuery 1.10.2 uh, that is available in the um, lib directory bootstrap jQuery dust that is jQuery.js so there is no need to uh, run jQuery individual if you have another uh, plugins which is related to the jQuery like the time picker control time picker.js so first of all add your JS uh, time picker under the JS folder that is uh, jQuery time picker.js file okay and after that you can uh, add your css as well as uh, this is the jquery time picker.css okay after add this file you must to drag and drop this file uh, just under the section of section script must to use the section script to run the js file after that this and the code also add the reference of the file is under the section is section script there is js file and the CSS file, that is the cascading style sheet file, is located anywhere in this page, that is CSS HTML. Okay, that file is under the section document ready, and the basic example that is input text ID is basic example, basic example dot time picker to call time picker disable time ranges is one to four m. I mean to one to three thirty and three fifty nines. So uh, run this project and. Uh, you can see that the output and uh, misplace the file if you misplace the JS file uh, there is no output gathering um, from this there is output successfully gathering but if you notice that there is the section control X and control V save this and run this file okay and you notice that there is no output gathering because the JS file is load first before your document so control exit and paste under the section script so thank you guys for watching this video keep watching my all other videos which is related to jQuery and many more things about uh, ASP.NET course thank you very much